80% of plastic that originates from land, including straws, ends up in the Great Pacific Garbage Patch. The Pacific Garbage Patch consists of 7 million tons of weight. The Pacific Garbage Patch can be up to 9 feet. The Pacific Garbage Patch has 6 times the amount of plastic as plankton. Plankton is a main food source in the ocean. Do you like using straws? Uh, yes. Yes! It depends what type of drink you yeah. have. How often do you guys use straws? I mean, I only use it sometimes, like if I go to a restaurant and I get a drink. That's usually the only time I use it. Or if I go to Starbucks. Yeah. Um, probably only when I go out to dinner with my family. Time. I just but like to use straws whenever I want to. Have you ever heard of any other replacements that you can use instead of straws? Um, I know you can use metal straws. I've used paper straws before. You can use paper, paper straws, or metal, or like glass, glass straws. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I've used a glass straw before. You guys know where your straws go after you throw them away? Um, Compost. Probably like the landfill or something. The to ocean. The landfill. Have you ever heard of the Pacific Garbage Patch? Here's a picture. Um, no, I've never heard of it. Yeah. So here's a picture of it. That's really big. Yes. yes. And yes, I've heard of the Great Pacific Garbage Patch, and because it traps here's like a picture lot. of it. Um, oh. So. There was a viral video of a turtle with a straw in its nose, and here's a picture of it. But <gasps> so after hearing this and seeing the picture, would you guys consider using other types of straws or asking for no straw? Um, yeah. Obviously. <laughs> Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yes. yes. <laughs>